I come from a long lineage of families that have served, families that have sacrificed. For me, when it comes to remembrance, I feel that Taking an active part is really important. Bridging this gap between our veterans who are passing away that experienced the Second World War, uh, there's only a handful of them left. I feel that it's our generation's responsibility because we're the last people to actually know them. My son asked me the other day, why did the soldiers get lost? And I told him that they got lost for us. And that also reminded me of just how important it is to share with him who these soldiers were because they were people like us. I've, I've had the opportunity to, to meet a lot of veterans. Um, I think of Willie and standing at his brother's grave. I, I was playing Amazing Grace on a flute for him and his brother. I just, I sh that was a special moment to share in that moment. And I felt connected to him, his brother. And yet, you know, here's another veteran with, with memories and stories. Um, he holds the memory of his brother and what happens when he passes? Where does the memory of his brother go? If there was just something we can do, we can't capture it all, but if we can just capture a piece of that, that history, um, who, who this soldier was, who his brother was. Um, and anytime we, we hold that in mind, then that soldier's not lost. This project is, is to help people grasp a bit of what that experience is like, what it's like to sit there and honor a soldier and remember them, more for just a name on a gravestone, but to see a picture of them, to, to hear a story of who they were. I think there's a real opportunity to use this technology in a way that connects people meaningfully to the past, to the stories of our soldiers that have, have given their lives for us to have what we have today.